Hello, <clears throat> doing a couple more videos here. This will be called the Antichrist Beast. I know I did some before, but this is kind of an updated version. It gives more information. So I'll do, have two of these. Uh, the Ancient Egyptian Calendar. We need to look at that. Ancient Egyptian Calendar, YouTube. Moses, Wikipedia. Second Commandment. That's my YouTube. Gives a bunch of good information about the Second Commandment. Uh, and, you know, and the Ten Commandments all together, or 17 Commandments, really. Etc. Cetera, Etc. Cetera. Egyptian calendar again. The Roman calendar. How they kept changing the days in the Roman calendars. Things like that. Roman calendar. Eight day week. Calendars one times eight days a week. Beatles song. Eight days a week. It's a good song. Listen to that one. <clears throat> Number of days in the of the week. They're all uh, all the days of the week are basically after named after the planets. You know, in the solar system. Inside Illuminati temple talks about the Saturn. The uh, God of time worship, you know, Saturn and Cronus and time. You know, you get the idea how that works. Saturday was Saturn's day. <clears throat> uh, you know, Saturn, the planet, Satan. Ernest Tubb, Saturday, Satan, Sunday, Saint. Good song. Need to listen to that one. Good lyrics. Saturday, Satan, YouTube. That's by Power Wolf. Good song. Listen to that. Second coming of Jesus, Apollo, and Ju Jupiter Zeus. That's my video. Need to look at that and all the links. Revelation 13. Jesus Christ is the Antichrist, Sabbath Covenant. Need to look at that about the true symbol or cryptogram of uh, who the Antichrist is. 666, according to the Ranter book. <clears throat> this is a definite video you need to watch, like a two-hour movie, but you need to watch it. Original, From Babylon to America, the prophecy movie. It's a great video. Who is the Antichrist? Good thing it explains it. it. Breaks it all down just like this movie. The movie explains it, you know, really great. And this guy kind of breaks it down in document, you know, in, in text. Blasphemy has two definitions of scripture, claiming to forgive sins. Hmm, interesting. Who do you think does that? Claiming to be God. What mortal man claims to do both of those, huh? I'm not talking about the Pope. Who else does this? Yeah, there's another one. Who else do you think does that? What does that remind you? Right up there. <clears throat> All right. Strange case of Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde. Yeah, Jesus was a pedophile. That's Jeffrey Daugherty and the Christian whistleblower. Pantera, Jesus' real father. A mediator definition. It could either be a, a mediator between two people, or it could also mean like middle, like a middleman between origin, original, and you, like a dealer who claims that you have to go through them to get to the OEM, the original equipment manufacturer. Hmm, sound familiar? Sound like a middleman, huh? Billy Eilish, hostage song. Critical knowledge, the legal ownership of all souls by the Vatican since 1306. Need to look at this thing. This is a great video. Need to look at that. Reformation Papacy. Doctrine of Discovery. Need to look at that. Forced Conversion, Wikipedia. Definitely look at that. Spanish Colonization of Americas. That's right after a course of Doctrine of Discovery by the Papal Bull, by the Vatican, the Popes. And American Slaves, White Slaves. Yes, American Slaves are White Slaves too. So that's number one. And I'll start number two in a bit. I have all the links.